Welcome back Crypto Millionaires Club. Today we're going to be talking about how you can get your ERC20s into your MetaMask wallet for the next snapshot aka the main launch. So let's go ahead and dive right into it. Now if you guys are big fans of Pulse Chain, Pulse X or Hex be sure that you smash up that like button and smash up that subscribe button. You guys can see that we're covering PulseX literally every single day, getting a massive amount of views. So be sure you guys are part of the family, all right? So diving right into it, you guys can see up here on the top right, we have Connect Wallet. You have an opportunity to connect many different wallets. We got MetaMask, we got Wallet Connect, we got Trust Wallet, we got Math Wallet, we got Token Pocket, we got Pulse Chain, we got SafePal, then we got Coin98. So you have many different wallets that you can use to connect whenever it comes to PulseX. So what we're gonna be talking about today is actually how you can connect a MetaMask wallet. Most importantly, how to get ERC20s into your MetaMask wallet. So if you guys don't know what MetaMask is, this is a wallet extension browser, okay? So this is a crypto wallet and gateway to blockchain apps. If you guys would like to, be sure that you click on download. This is gonna give you an opportunity to download it on Edge, iOS, Android, or any type of browser that you have, all right? So once you click on download, this is gonna take you to a place where you can install it. Obviously, I already have it installed. You guys can see that. But once you have it installed, you guys need to follow all of the instructions okay so you guys will see that i do have a metamask wallet right here at this current moment and i am actually on the ethereum mainnet you guys are probably thinking well why are you on the ethereum mainnet when everything's going to be prc 20s well remember that anything that is in your metamask wallet is automatically going to be copied over to prc 20s so which i already have right here at this current moment okay so what I'm going to go ahead and do is actually show you how you can go ahead and get your coins or tokens, whatever the case may be, into your MetaMask wallet. So I am going to go to Coinbase. You guys can see right now I've got about five bucks of Bitcoin and that is it. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm actually going to go ahead and buy. I'm going to buy up some Ethereum really quick and then I'm going to show you how you can actually send it to your MetaMask wallet. All right. So in this case, we're going to go right here. We're going to go to Ethereum and we're going to say, let's, let, let's buy probably probably like $15 or something like that. So we're gonna go ahead and click on buy and you guys are gonna see that it's going to show up instantly, right? This is exactly what's happening right now at this moment, all right? So it is about to pop up into my exchange, right? It's gonna pop up into my accounts. So you guys can see where it states, successfully purchased, all right? So I successfully purchased my Ethereum, right? Now I got about $18 at this current moment. So I'm gonna click right here, Ethereum. You guys can see where we can take a look at the overview. We can take a look at the wallet. We can take a look at the vault. We can do whatever we like, all right? So in this case, we need to get our PRC20s as stated into our MetaMask wallet. This is what we need to do. So how do you do that? Well, we're going to click on send and receive. So we're actually going to send Ethereum and we're going to send all. We're going to send as much as we can here, okay? And what I need to do is I need to copy the address on my MetaMask wallet. It is right here. You can see where it states account one, copy to clipboard. We're actually going to go ahead and click on copy and that is it. So we're going to go ahead and go here and we're going to put the address in, right? So you have to put the address right here in the middle. Now you don't have to do this with just Ethereum. You need to do this with all ERC20s or any ERC20s that you have. Very easy and very simple. So I'm going to leave a note. I'm going to put MetaMask. That is what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead and click on continue. And most likely it's going to ask me for a code like a verification code and i'm gonna have to put that in just really really quick and then we will go ahead and continue and i will show you exactly what you should expect all right so we're gonna go ahead and put that in just really quick boom there we go and it's gonna tell us that there is a confirmation and that it is being sent all right ladies and gentlemen so while we are currently waiting at this moment you guys can see where it states sent nine dollars and 85 cents to that address right so we're going to go back to the pulse x page and we should be waiting slowly 
for our MetaMask wallet. It will actually show up here, here in just a little bit. We can even click on activity, but it is gonna take some time, all right? So here in a few minutes, we're gonna cover it again, and I will show you guys that the Ethereum has been sent to my wallet, all right? So as we have stated, once you get to PulseX, you need to make sure you click on connect your wallet, all right? Connect your MetaMask wallet. That is what I'm doing right now, as stated at this current moment. We're gonna switch networks and we are going to go to PRC20s. So we are on the Pulse Chain test net, all right? So you guys can see we have an opportunity to swap PLS for PLSX, whatever the case may be, all right? You can use whatever you want. You can swap it out for other tokens, whatever the case may be, it is up to you, all right? So right now, what we're waiting for as we're waiting for the Ethereum as stated to get into our wallet, all right? So boom, there it is. Ethereum is already in my wallet. So ladies and gentlemen, what you're gonna do is you are gonna send any type of ERC20s that you have to your MetaMask wallet, all right? So whether that's Ethereum, right? Whether that's uh, say USDT, whether that's, uh, I don't know, any other coins that you have that are ERC20s. You want to send them to your MetaMask wallet and you want to keep them there because once they do the snapshot, you're gonna instantly, you're gonna instantly see a copied pair, a one-on-one -on -one ratio over on your Pulse Chain testnet. Now, like I stated, the snapshot has not happened. We've had one for the testnet, but we are waiting for one for the main net. So make sure you send all of your ERC20 tokens to your MetaMask wallet and you need to hold them there until after everything is done. I would say wait until after the main launch before you move any tokens. The whole point, the whole point here of sending everything to your MetaMask wallet is so it gets copied from an ERC20 to a PRC20 and then you can trade those PRC20s on the Pulse X DEX. So ladies and gentlemen, that is all I got for you. If you have any comments, leave them down below, but other than that, have a great one. We'll see you later and ciao.